Normally we'd have 150 crew and cast here, and uh, this place would be buzzing. Standing on the empty set of the hit show The Good Doctor shot in Burnaby, the impact of the writer's strike in the U.S. is already visible. The scripts eventually run out. So a feature film that is written could continue and shoot regardless. And a, uh, but a television series that typically is writing, we get scripts 10 days before you shoot them often, that uh, that will grind to a halt very quickly. BC is home to other hit shows like Yellow Jackets, Riverdale, and soon... Season two of the HBO smash hit The Last of Us. Last year alone, the film industry injected $3.6 billion into the provincial economy, employing around 40,000 people, 88,000 if you include freelancers. In a statement, Creative BC says this strike is far more complex than the one in 2007 because of changing business models, adding the global context of the industry has changed. <laughs> Striking workers are asking for better compensation from shows distributed through streaming platforms and minimum staffing for writers' rooms, among other demands. Part of the, the show is set in San Jose, so this is an exterior of their apartment. So Late night shows where jokes are written week to week are already airing reruns, and depending how long the strike lasts, viewers may feel the impacts well into the fall. You won't see new episodes of the uh, network primetime shows airing in September if this goes on for months. If this is a few weeks, there'll be no significant impact. If we have a three or four month strike, then you'd see a massive impact on those shows. A more long-term concern, the contracts for the Screen Actors Guild and the Directors Guild are also up in June. So more potential strikes in Hollywood. So there's nothing we can do, but there, there will be thousands of crew members out of work. Could lead to more quiet sets in BC. Michelle Gassoub, CBC News, Burnaby.